And here with you again, along with Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal, for what is still a very new, a very fresh NBA season. Hello, everybody. Welcome so back to Hollywood Sports. Playing against the My Chicago career. Sports. Let's do it. For Chicago, they lost game one in this matchup earlier. If you're new season. to the channel, guys, uh, this is Hollywood, all, my creative player, series and he's on the out. Indiana Pacers. And Al Jefferson, an offensive presence when he's on the floor, heading into the back end of his career now, but still putting up good numbers. Kenny, just what does he bring to What's the up, table? Kenny? What, talk to me, Kenny. Well, he's a guy that you have to double in a low block. You know, if you play him one-on-one, -on -one, he's tough to deal with. So he draws lots of attention. He gets up. He gets fouled. He can shoot free throws. He is a load in the box. You know, he's older now. doesn't command the same amount of touches as he did when he was younger. But Big Al always puts that work in on offense. That's why I nickname him Baby Fundamentals. Baby Fundamentals. <laughs> Oh, sort of like Tim Duncan, but it's baby fundamentals. <laughs> that does it for us for now. Uh, we'll see you later. Shaq look crazy, don't he? <laughs> All right, Bulls against the Pacers, baby. Let's watch Hollywood get down, get down. On the road looking for a win against an Eastern Conference rival. The Chicago Bulls are ready for this thing to get started. It's the NBA, and it's locked right here on 2K Sports. That's how we're shooting that jet right there. Yeah. Look at it. <laughs> I just styling the pro box. Get out of the chairs, Hollywood. Do your thing, baby. Do your thing. From the field in that game. Credit the defense, though, because even when they got open looks, no rhythm to knock them down. They never let them. Hollywood got his waves rolling on his head. Look at it. He's styling out there. All game long. As things get ready to roll, let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's on the sideline. David? Hey, Kevin. Well, most of the attention in this year's draft has gone to Prez, but just as Young has shown, he could be the steal of the draft. Passed on by many due to his size, he has shown early that he can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with any other guard in the league. And his team just raves about his work ethic and his willingness to be coached. Not bad for a player every team passed on in the first round, huh, guys? <laughs> Thank you, David. Young, just the latest steal to come as a second-round pick. Well, guys like Draymond Green and Marcus Gasol were second-rounders as well. And there are some great players in Let's the league. Let's go, baby. Over Let's go. Over. In this game pitting two conference rivals against one another. A little extra riding on this one. We'll see it, too. Yeah, you'll see, because the game will get a little chippy, a little physical, and both of these teams understand they both can't get to the conference finals. Oh, talking out there, too, huh? Yeah. Were, you, were, you, were you a talker? Big talker. Were you? Yes. I you know, Hollywood's not a starter, guys. He's not a starter. At least I not yet. The connection. I've been waiting. I finally figured it out. They usually don't take long to put him in the game. There he is, number 10, baby. Number 10. Wait outside. Let's a floater go. That shot off the mark. So Indiana will take it the other way. They put up a nice win against the Bucks the last time out. Yeah, the confidence just exuding in that performance on the offensive end. I mean, it really illustrates how this team clicks. Oh, I thought Holloway usually hit that, baby. As a cohesive unit. Team chemistry goes a long way in terms of overall team success. And this group exudes that every game. You know what? Tried to step in and cut him off, but just All right, Hollywood, let's go, baby. CJ Miles checked in for Indiana. Brooks comes in for Jeff T. The Bulls making a change here as well. Nick Dermott. Stay on Butler, baby. Stay on Butler. Gibbs on the screen. Cannon kicks to Mirror. No, that's all. That's all. Let's run it, baby. Let's run it. No good. Brooks outside. Outside, George. Takes the three. Some solid defense from Butler. Bulls trail by eight. McDermott dishes to Cannon. Don't bother Hollywood. Stay on him, baby. Now here's McDermott. He's covered closely. A shot. No good. Here's George. That ball. Nice feed that time from Turner. Defensively, they've been a step slow Always been here trying to get his to start. rebounding numbers up. Chicago has gone 0-3 from three-point land. Nothing yet going outside. 
And with the Bulls, there has been a sense of disconnect between the front office and the coaching staff. We've read about it, we've heard wow. about it. And the fans and the players throw them into the mix too for quite some time. Steve, the stigma just hasn't gone away. Something that will shoot that three, Hollywood. Shoot that three, baby. Get back to oh, what are you throwing the ball at, bro? Start to slide. There's a lot of finger pointing. That Hollywood handle the ball, man. And some changes here for the Pacers. Lavoy Allen comes in for George. Rodney Stuck. Hollywood's out already. Let him get a breather. Bobby Portis has checked in for the Bulls. 59 seconds left to play in the first quarter. From deep, Brooks. Yeah. First shot, first pass. He's out of the blocks fast. It's taken them no time to build this lead up. Great first quarter offensive. And who needs to warm up? They did. You guys, Hollywood yeah. learns a lot sitting on the bench watching the action, man. You know, he's a rookie this year. It's taken away by Stuckey. Push it, push it, push it. At the way, wait. No, he gave it up. Okay. And the story here is Kevin early on. All right, Hollywood, let's roll, baby. They got you back in the game. Come on now. Paul George comes in for CJ Myers. Prime times checked in for Rodney Stuckey. Young is subbed in for Aaron Brooks. So Chicago going with an almost entirely new group. Lopez, he's checked in for Gibson. Miritich comes in for Portis. Dwayne Wade's checked in for Jimmy Butler. Ajan Rondo subbed in for Cannon. So for Chicago right now, Hollywood can dunk. McDermott and Miritich, the sharpshooting forward. Oh, Hollywood, stay with him, baby. Out there with Rajon Rondo. Don't let Wade do that to you. In at the five spot. If you let Wade get the ball that deep, there really isn't anything you can do. George against Wade. Here's there you go, Hollywood. There you go, baby. Oh! Ah, that was in and out. Ah, oh, man. Ask for a better look. Sometimes it just doesn't go down. Guys, he's having a ball out there. I mean, we knew going in that he'd have an advantage on the glass. Look at Prez. Look at Prez. He could be this dominant. What a difference. And he's not going to back off. Even with that That's big That's Apollo Creed, lead, son, man. That's Apollo Creed, son, right there. To keep stretching out their lead. The base is shooting their first free throw of the night here. Man, they got Hollywood on Wade, baby. Lock him down. Kind of define that old school. Lock him down, Hollywood. Defensive oriented team. And then oh, man. They just flipped the script last season. There you go. Get the ball. Get the ball. Push it. Push it, Hollywood. Playing much of that season with four perimeter players on the court and finding ways Bam. to be successful. Good shot, baby. And what can you say Good about shot. Young? Hollywood got an assist, baby. He's fought his way into the NBA and carved out his place. And you have to give all the credit to Young as he is not all about scoring all the time, man. Worker has never been viewed as a dominant player, but he just continues to improve it. But he's still in Hollywood. Game each and Good every team, baby. There are many heartbreaking uh, stories in the NBA, but Prez's is right up there. Lost his father, former police officer, in a car accident at age 14. Just a tragedy to befall Prez and his family. And it's why he's so close to his mom now. But Prez loved his dad, and a lot of how he plays and acts is in honor of his memory. I know if his father were alive today, he'd be bursting with pride in how his son has grown into a man. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Well, guys, we know Jimmy Butler made a big bet on himself back in 2014. He turned down the Bulls' four-year, $44 million contract extension offer, and it paid off. After a breakthrough season, he signed a new contract, a max deal for five years and $95 million. Instead of his decision... There you go, Hollywood. That's your shot, office, baby. Uh, going to lie oh, to come you. on, baby. Everything I put myself through, I knew what I was capable of. He's come a long way, David. Thank you. Now, here's Rondo. After the miss from primetime... Two minutes. They set the pick. Miritich up top. They call Hollywood primetime in case you didn't know. Rebound goes to the Pacers. Come on, baby. Push Just it. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding has been off the charts. And the call will be against They call charging on Hollywood? That's his first foul. Yeah, really good defensive play oh, to come off there and square up. And Hollywood's back on the bench, the guys. Al Jefferson, he's checked in for Miles Turner. Ellis comes in for primetime. And it's Teagan for Young. Then for the Bulls, Taj Gibson's checked in for Lopez. Bobby Portis comes in for Doug McDermott. And it's Jimmy Butler coming in for Dwayne Wade. Outside for Ronda. Pass to Miritich. Second shot. Hollywood's going back in and they make this buck. And it's Here we go. Coming on the assist by Rajon Rondo. For the first half, Pacers lead by 15. Half time. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks, Kevin. Dwayne, is defense where you're going to win this game? 
Well, uh, it is. You know, we got to get more stops, and when we get opportunities to get on transition, we got to look up and we got to get the ball up. I think right now we get rebounds and we we're taking a, a break. We got to go, man. We got a very deep team. We got to use it. So I like the jerseys. Look to run a little more. Yeah, walking it up isn't going to get it done against this team. Thanks, Dwayne. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks so much, Dave, for the great interview. Don't go away, folks. We'll be back for the second half of basketball. Right That's right, this. guys. Hollywood's doing my career. Hollywood's doing my career videos. What a little different twist as usual. All right, gentlemen, hustle up. That was a great first half. Hey, this is what happens when we play our brand of basketball. They cannot stop us. Now stay focused, guys. Let's win this game and go home. Got my red skin colors on. <laughs> and we return to Indianapolis, Indiana, with a look at all the activity taking place in this terrific downtown. Well, it's been a one-sided affair so far through the first two quarters, but there's plenty of time to mount a comeback. Without question, he's checked in for Indiana. Prime time comes in for Ellis. And a change for the Bulls. Doug McDermott, he's checked in for Miritich. And Smithy, when you were a young player in the league and taking on the great legends of the 90s, were there any games where you were just in awe of who you were on the court facing? A lot, Kevin. Come on, Hollywood, what's up? Baby, you up tonight. Jordan. Going up against the great Michael Jordan. A lot of people say they played against Michael, but he played the two-guard position. Right at and you. And I huh? had to guard oh him, my God. and he was guarding me. And then growing up in Detroit, rip him, rip him, rip. I had a chance to work out with Isaiah Thomas, Joe Dumars, and then compete against these guys. Those are the three names that come to mind. I think those are the three that really had an influence on my game. And the, mo the single most difficult guy for you to cover? By far. I couldn't cover him. That was Michael Jordan. And who, who was a guy that was the best defensive player on you, guarding you. And he was a teammate of mine, so a lot in practice, but then when he was, we got traded and separated, Stacy Altman, the plastic no man. Get more playing time, Holloway. Start Prime hitting your J's, bro. Prime time. He's in a shooting guard. Al Jefferson out there. He is in a shooting slot. Then it's Paul George. You can make McMillan. And at the point guard position. So that's the group out there for Indiana. Here's Jefferson. Makes a big height bounce and goes in. Jefferson's got five now. Not the best pick I've ever seen, but it was just enough to get the job done. Wade outside. They would impress. They would impress. Good D, baby. It to Lopez. Six on the shot clock. McDermott kicks to run. Good on the shot, and that shaves the lead. It's entirely new group in now for Indiana. Lavoy Allen's checked in for Jefferson. Young comes in for Turner. Prime Times checked in for George. And it's Brooks in for Young. Taj Gibson's checked in for Chicago. Portis comes in for Rajon Rondo. So the Bulls five right now. Oh, good pass. They've got Portis. Taj Gibson is out there with Robin Lopez. Then there's Dwayne Wade. Hollywood is in his position running the play, baby. To the paint. Puts it up. Bank shot. No good. One item that stood out, their ball move. Things are definitely clicking, and more importantly, it makes it really hard to defend. Prime time, the pass to Brooks. From downtown, and it's Wade with the rebound. Game's almost over, baby. So no problem for Indiana. All right, we get the win. And the outcome of Hollywood was off tonight. And boy, they really put in a supreme effort. I like his cut, though. Hollywood, Hollywood got that fresh cut, man. That lead, and it was comfortable. They were not going. Hollywood got an assist and a rebound, though. That'll do it, folks. For Greg Anthony, <laughs> David Aldridge, Steve Smith, and the rest of our terrific 2K sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. See you next time.